You, you ever have one of those days where you just need a big cup of coffee? This, my friends, is the world's largest coffee cup. It fits 20 cups of coffee. Well, in order to do that, you must find the biggest pot of coffee. Howdy folks, Jay here. Welcome to another great vlog. Uh, today, uh, I am currently in uh, Morgantown, West Virginia. Uh, I'm getting ready to head over to uh, a little town called Bedford, Pennsylvania, where there is a really large coffee pot. Yep, that's what today is all about. It's gonna go see a very large coffee pot. And if they have coffee, then we'll get a cup of coffee too at the big coffee pot in Bedford, Pennsylvania. All right, well, here we go. Howdy folks, I am just as excited to show you this as much as I am as excited to be here. That makes sense? And this is Ricky the Dragon Steamboat's cup of coffee in the big time, yeah. Anyway, I'm excited, we're finally here at Bedford, Pennsylvania, and my golly, we're here. It's the coffee pot. That's exciting, right? <laughs> I knew you'd find it exciting. Or you wouldn't still be watching. Well, you might not be watching. You might have turned it off by now. So let's see if it's open. Okay. Oh no. Apparently no one's home inside the coffee pot. It's more like a visitor center. But uh, anyway. At least they, they have this here. Anyway, folks were coming up with crazy ideas like this coffee pot here along the Lincoln Highway uh, to try to drag more motorists, you know, to come check out whatever this crazy thing was. This one here was built in 1927 and again was to attract visitors to his adjacent gas station. So. You know, that was kind of the idea. But in 1937, it was converted into a bar, and then a hotel was built kind of in the rear. But uh, in 2004, it was moved from its original location across town and brought here to this spot now. So now it just sits as a reminder of some of the really cool things that you could find along the Lincoln Highway. Yeah. That's the coffee pot. Awesome. <laughs> it's so cool, isn't it? <laughs> Fun. Hi, excuse me. Yeah, do you know anything about the uh, the coffee pot here? I know when I was a kid it was right down the road, but that's about all I know about it. They moved it there a couple years ago. Cool, thanks. So uh, here I am at the Bedford Moose Lodge, and I figured if anyone's going to know anything about the big coffee pot, some of the guys here might know, so let's go take a look. Welcome, Welcome to, to Bedford, Bedford Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. And more enthusiasm and go for it. Welcome to Bedford, Pennsylvania. <laughs> That's about as enthusiastic as you're gonna get around here, folks. <laughs> I don't know all the history now. I know for years and years it was a, it was a, a local bar. 
It was just a local bar. That little, that it was it's small though. I mean, yeah, but there was another part of that. There was a building attached to it. There was a building attached to it. Yeah. Okay. The band used to set up there in the actual coffee bar to play for the bar. Right. Oh, okay. And you actually hit it with your car once. Yeah. It was right in front. When I pulled in, we were. It wasn't like I said, it wasn't our first stop. When I pulled in, I just got a little bit too close. Ooh, a little too close to it. <laughs> All right. Yeah, so, it's a, so it's now a dented big coffee pot. I think they fixed it. <laughs> I think oh, they probably yeah. did, yeah. It looks like they fixed it, yeah. Is there like a big coffee pot festival? Yeah. Do they serve coffee in there? Probably because it was a bar. <laughs> <laughs> now they should serve coffee. Just, just for a joke, how much is a cup of coffee here at the Moose? 50 cents. 50 cents. It's always, always great to keep your Moose Lodge dues good. So you just be able to go into places like that. It's awesome. All right. Let's see what else we can find. a big cup of coffee anyway here I am in Everett Pennsylvania home of the big ass quarter all right really it's just a big quarter but it's a big ass quarter no anyway <laughs> so this quarter right here in case you couldn't hear me over the because I'm so far away. This corner here is in Everett, Pennsylvania. Actually, George Washington used to kind of hang around this area. There was a pub down the street he used to go to. There's a hotel he stayed at. So, yeah, I guess a quarter kind of fits. And if I am going to buy a big cup of coffee, I'll probably need two of those. Because average price apparently is 50 cents. Anyone has any idea where to find a second quarter? You just let me know. Comment below. Oh, and don't forget, hit like and subscribe. Remember, folks, whatever you do, get out there and have fun. See you next time.